Welcome back to Christopher's Knowledge Discovery, guys. Good to see you all back here. We've got some news articles today, uh, which are quite worrying. If we start off with this first one, um, Biden supporters begin drawing up revenge list of Trump allies. So this is to do with uh, the notion that's been going around that uh, the Trump supporters need to be punished for voting for Trump. And we've got various tweets that were sent out with this one. No, seriously, how do you deprogram 75 million people? Where do you start? Fox, Facebook, we have to start thinking in terms of post-World War II Germany or Japan or the failures of reconstruction in the South. So this is, uh, it's quite worrying language this is, because these are political uh, views that the left doesn't uh, agree with and simply finds that these people are not allowed to hold these views are not allowed to vote for Trump and let's just look at this beauty here re-education camps for those salvageable firing squad for irredeemable malcontents round up entire families to ensure the disease doesn't spread now this talk here is pure communist talk this is murderous communist talk what you're seeing here in front of you this is out there people and this is not coming from right-wing extremists or uh, neo-Nazis or whatever. This this is coming from the political left, from their people, from their uh, crowd. And if we go on to other news, COVID, uh, South South Australia to enter circuit breaker lockdown. This is a new lockdown that's happening in Australia. And if you've been keeping up with what's going on in Australia, the lockdowns are just uh, horrendous. So some of the uh, rules are people must stay home and cannot leave for exercise. Wear a mask to be mandatory in public. All schools, universities closed except for children of essential workers. Shops, restaurants, cafe, pubs closed with no takeaway options. Bans on regional travel. So... Did you just see that or read that and just take it in that once one you can stay at home but you're not allowed to exercise so you you were allowed to exercise previously but now you're not mask wearing mandatory all schools close except for those essential workers so the essential workers children can go to school but not yours Sub restaurants and pubs closed no takeaways so your food is limited to supermarkets and then no travel no regional travel so this is complete communist lockdown people and I'm just going to show you a video that's coming up and I'm going to leave it there. This is about uh, a, a podcast uh, doctor that was arrested in Europe. And yeah, I'll leave you with that. Diese einzelne Ereignisse rausfischen muss, anhand deren ich Zeitlinien rekonstruiere. Also das ist, ähm, es ist ja, prinzipiell ist ja alles parallel gleichzeitig da. Ne? Und es gibt, es gibt keine Lebensvariante, die nicht existiert, sondern alles existiert parallel gleichzeitig. Jede Wirklichkeit, jede Entschuldigung, Entschuldigung kurz. Entschuldigung, hier, die Polizei ist gerade da. Die Polizei ist gerade da. Ja. Und jetzt? Mach mal bitte auf. Ja, ich weiß nicht, was los ist. Das ist doch, das ist doch keine Ich Schöne. weiß nicht. Äh, Guck mal, wir haben vorhin über Angst gesprochen. Moment, hier ist gerade die Polizei, bricht gerade die Tür auf. Polizei! Polizei! Ich bin 
die Hände sehen, auf dem Boden, auf dem Boden, unsere Beine, runter auf den Boden. Geh runter! Zwei Personen hier, am Boden liegen bleiben. Wie sind Ihre Namen? Wie heißen Sie? Wie heißen Sie? Ich bin Andreas Noack. Sonst irgendwelche Messer, Waffen, irgendwas einstecken? Nein. Computer aus. 